Hey everyone, so today I'm recording on my new iTouch. I hope the quality is okay. I mean, I know it's not going to be like perfect because it's like an, it's an iTouch. So I'm not expecting anything huge, but I'm just going to record my foundation routine really fast. So let's get started. So first I'm going to pull my hair back just with a headband to keep it out of my face. Because I really don't want to get makeup in my hair or hair in my makeup. It's kind of gross. Um, then the first thing I'm going to do is moisturize. And I'm using the Aqua CoverGirl Smoothers in light to medium. I'm sorry, everything's backwards on this. Like I said, it's an eye touch. But I think it's pretty okay. I'm just going to squeeze it on the back of my hand like so. And take a foundation brush and just apply it all over my face. Well, make sure to take it down your neck, you know, just to make sure it all blends in well. And now I'm just going to rub it in with my hands to make sure it's all good and rubbed in everywhere. And especially on my eyes because they are really, the skin around them is really thin so it needs to be moisturized extra. So that's what I do first. Now, I'm going to take my Revlon Colorstay foundation, and I'm in the color, um, I just saw it, and now I lost it, 180 Sand Beige, I know, backwards, that's so annoying, and I'm just going to take out my finger and dot it where it needs to go on my face instead of pouring it on my hands so I know I'm using it all instead of wasting it because this stuff is really good and I don't want to waste it and put a little bit on my eye and a little bit under yeah and I'm going to screw the top on before I spill this on my carpet and now I'm just going to take this Sonia Keshek flat top brush that needs to be cleaned and just Stipple that into my skin. <sighs> Sorry, I'm kind of sick, so my voice is messed up and I'm like all sniffly. That's why. And now I'm just gonna buff it in there really good and get my jawline and everything. and blend it into my hairline and just everywhere now I'm gonna take my hands again and just make sure that's all blended in good like that now I'm gonna take my benefit erase paste backwards again and this is in medium sorry the mail truck's coming by so it's kind of loud because it's like snowy outside which is good um, and I'm just going to take a concealer brush like this and just put this right under my eye in the dark circle kind of shadowy area oh I hate being sick and the same on the other eye And a little bit around my nose, just in case. And now, I'm just going to blend it out a little with a foundation brush around my nose. And tap it out with my fingers under my eye. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Rub it in a little bit. Like that. I really like this stuff a lot. 
it helps very much. And now I'm just going to set all that with a powder. And this is my um, mineralized skin finish natural in light medium. But I put it in this packaging, which used to be like my Briar Rose um, beauty powder. But now it's this. And... Mm. Goodness. And now I'm just going to take this Eco Tools powder brush and apply this all over my face to set the foundation. And I'm just going to blend that out a little bit more with this brush. This brush is super soft, and if I didn't say it's by Eco Tools. Ooh, sorry. Eco Tools. And now I'm just going to take an e.l.f. blush brush. And it's e.l.f. You guys can't see that. I'm trying to get it to where you guys can see it because it's like silver and it's hard to see. And I'm going to take my... MAC Bite of an Apple Blush and just apply this on my cheeks and the other one and now I'm going to take my NARS Orgasm Illuminator and just stab that on my cheek and on my other cheek and just blend that out with the flat top brush again. And it just gives me a really nice glow that you guys probably can't see. So, um, yeah, that's my foundation routine. And if you guys want to see my everyday eye look, um, I'll do another video on that. So thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.